Last Labor Day, we had what looked to be fair weather and decided to head to Land Between the Lakes in western Kentucky to find some dispersed camping and get the turtleback trailer out for a couple nights. In our typical fashion, we got a late start, and well, by the time we got down there, I was getting a little worried about finding a good camp before dark. Other side. You sweating yet? Yeah. Other side. You'll make it? Yeah. Are we ready? Yeah. Okay, so we left Lexington today going to Land of Lakes, Land Between the Lakes, Kentucky, shares with Kentucky and Tennessee if you go far enough south, but it's full of dispersed camping, and we've been driving, it's about a three and a half hour drive to get here, then you got to find your camp, and I had a spot in mind, we decided that wasn't going to was work. Far away far but now we're driving around and can't find a spot so <laughs> we're gonna see if we get lucky here and uh, hopefully get camp up before it gets too dark and try and get some supper made so we'll check in a little bit later fortunately Leanne's satellite at map searching paid off and we found a secluded camp right next to a little boat ramp Trevor, got settled in Getting the mushrooms going. Muscooms. The muscooms. Muscooms. Mm -hmm. mm. Whoa, don't those look good? Oh, it's dark. <laughs> oh my. Focus on the food. It's very dark. <laughs> Ooh, put your headlamp on there. Mm. Fresh zucchini and mushrooms and steak ribeyes, thick, thick ribeyes tonight on the fire. So we made it to a camp. And we are finally sitting down lakeside with a cup of coffee and the DOGs. And it's lovely. We wound up finding a place. It's, it's right back there. Trevor still crashed out. And uh, it worked for the night. We actually had an awesome ribeye dinner with sauteed mushrooms and zucchini. And butter it was so awesome <laughs> and uh, hung out had a great uh, real fire that was cool and uh, today we're debating on what's the next play if we're gonna drive south leave camp here and go to Turkey Bay um, and go get a little off-road loop in or be ultra adventurous and head to Persimmon Beach, uh, which I've seen some YouTube videos of and it looks really awesome. But uh, whether or not it's a good idea to take the turtle back down there, not knowing according to any map that we can conjure, it's like as soon as you hit the trail, it takes like an hour and a half. So it doesn't look like a long distance which tells me it might be sort of rough but I don't know the videos I've seen doesn't look bad but anyway so in the meantime here we are hanging out how old is Lucy she's about as old as you are she, Seven? yeah pretty much because we got her right before you were born. When? In when's her birthday? November. November? Yeah, we got her in November, and she was just a pup. I would say she wasn't more than three or four weeks old. After some coffee and breakfast, we decided to just hang around camp for the day. I think we all really just needed to slow down for a day and enjoy some relaxing time together. You want bacon, Connor? Yeah. You gonna eat some bacon? Yeah. How many pieces? 100,000, 100,000 million pieces. Coming right up. Do we got that many? Yep. 
All right. <laughs> How many pieces are you going to have, Trev? Hmm? Bacon. Bacon. <laughs> How many pieces do you want? So if anyone noticed how tired Trev looks, he was up till 3 a.m. that morning at a friend's gaming. Tell me what you're eating. I'm eating an over medium egg. Mm, is it good? Yeah. Show it to me. I can't see it. You get a lot, I get... It was great to cast a few lines and play some checkers with the boys. I don't think we even got a nibble, but it felt good to slow down, even just for a short bit. Well, it was time to get some food going. Tonight we decided to cook on the gas fire pit. Chicken fajitas, veggies, and street corn. Yum. Making a cookie dough mug thing right here. Connor's making mud pie. <laughs> Terry's chopping vegetables. No. Are you making mud pancakes? Or mud brownies? Or is that a cow patty? Mud taco? No. I'm making... Oh my God. I'm making some cookie dough. Oh. Cover this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, I need this cut open. You got, um... After a delicious meal, we were treated with a beautiful sunset followed by a bright moon to enjoy. The next morning, we headed south to stop at a general store for ice and a few items, then head over to Turkey Bay to hit a little off-road loop. Home place.
as you can see, we weren't the only ones out playing in the mud that day. side by side out there on that point yeah that's cool i wonder if it's safe to come out here what do you mean you get stuck, yeah, you get stuck. there's a crane over here but who knows how to dad let's run around and stuff well honey i got the dogs with us that's pretty isn't it so i need to be careful We are right now. We're Yay, gonna... friends and things. Friends and things. Friends and things. Well, that crane was eating something. Yeah, he's eating. Uh -huh. See, wait, I'm not wait, trying wait. to get stuck either, buddy. Um, <laughs> I really way. don't want to put my mud boots on. <laughs> you got them? Well, I got a pair of tennis shoes. Because I've got flip flops. <laughs> have to beg somebody to come get us out. If Nothing else. Oh, look how pretty this is. This is a good way to get stuck right here. That right ahead. Oh, yeah. I don't think we should cross that. Evidence. We did hit some orange. <laughs> I just put it in low because you have so much more control and it's just smoother versus high where you, you're making it the engine and the gears work harder. Thank you. 
I don't really want to do that. Go left here. Because it's a pain to put them back, put them back in on. and all yeah. that. They've come in and graveled all this. Yeah, probably because you couldn't get up it. You think? Yeah. I don't know. Does it bend there? It says to the Well, right. that's what he did. It doesn't mean that that's the way it goes. I don't know what we're on, though. After some fun at Turkey Bay, we headed back to camp for our last night. We didn't make a big production out of dinner that night. I think we just did spaghetti. Anyhow, the next morning we packed up camp in a downpour. But we got it all battened down and started our way back home. Okay, so Labor Day weekend 2022. We went to Land Between the Lakes. And um, it's, been, it's been fun. A little trying. I think the family kind of learned a couple things about each other this weekend. Um, we just stayed for two nights and we just packed up camp. We are completely soaked and just crazy muddy. You can't see it. Um, dogs the are dogs dry. are dry but filthy. filthy and we are hitched up and we are leaving and going back to Lexington Peace. and home. Peace out. It was obvious we were all tired, especially little Connor, who was a bit grumpy. We did find a good spot to eat right on Lake Barkley called Hoobies. It's always nice to have someone cook for you after a couple days at camp. Oh, and ice cream always helps. Till the next time. Here. Ah.